This is air traffic control. All appears to be well in the skies above the airport. I can neither see nor hear anything untoward. Don't worry, sir. That isn't the sound of a UFO. I just ate a slightly dodgy curry last night. I'll do the checks. Delta Charlie Foxtrot Tango Oscar Zulu X-ray. Is it X-ray? Or is it xylophone? I can never remember. It doesn't matter, really. I'm just saying stuff to make me sound clever. Hang on a moment. Sir, there appears to be a strange object entering our airspace. And it seems to have just stopped. Ed and Ocho wanted to show, so went to the car hotel and picked up a blimp to show all the wimps who said that the mission would fail. They flew it away to pirate the waves and hack into your TV. Transmission impossible. Transmitting to show them all that we are unstoppable and absolutely incredible. Transmission impossible. Get out of bed without showing it. Transmission Impossible. Hello! Oh, hello. hello! Good morning! You're watching Transmission Impossible <laughs> with Ed and Outcho. And we're just floating up here in the oh, sky, dear. having a nice, relaxing Sunday morning, because we've been working flat out for 11 <laughs> weeks <laughs> to entertain you, so we thought we'd take it easy today. <sighs> so, did you see yesterday's show? You did? Huh? And you're wondering whether our stowaways enjoyed their time with us? Well, you're in luck. Have a look at this. Look into the camera and tell us what you really think about the show, yeah? Really speak your mind. I think Transmission Impossible with Ed and Out Show is really good. Um, I think Transmission Impossible with Ed and Out Show was really, really good. I think they were really good. But they're not. They're rubbish. I can't wait to get off this blimp. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I don't know what happened at the end there. You see, they loved it. They and today's show is going to be just as good. Mm. Oh, here yeah, comes the ether balls. Going to be even better. The air goes my hula. You've got a new item. Yeah, right, yeah. what's that then? Outcho's boss bottle dog. Outcho's thought for the day. Yeah. Right, so yeah, look forward to that, Radio 4 listeners. Huh? What was that? Yeah. Hello, hello. This is air traffic control, contacting an airship that has strayed into a major airport flight path. Over. Hmm. Uh, uh, no, 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 I don't think it's us. No, no, no. no. The blimp in question is bright green and looks like it's falling to pieces. Over. Oh, on second thoughts, that probably is us. Huh? <laughs> we request that you move your ship immediately. Over. Oh, right. Um... Hello? Oh. Uh, hello? Hello, this is Ed and Out Show. Uh, I think it's our blimp you're talking about. Now, we did have some plans for this morning. Uh, we were going to, you know, do the crossword, uh, play table tennis, have a jacuzzi, oh, that kind of thing. Me. Maybe eat some bananas. Indeed. Yeah, so we'll move our blimp after that. Mm -hmm. Is that OK? Oi, is that right? Oi. Stay over. Over. Oh. Over. Negative. You must move your blimp immediately. We are in control of this airspace and demand you move. Over. Oh, really? You demand we move it, do you? Eh? Mm. You demand we move it? Well, we're not going to. Nice. Yeah, we're pirates of the airways. We do whatever we like. Indeed. And I told you we've got stuff to do, so we're just going to leave our blimp here mm. uh, until it's done. In about the same amount of time it takes to bake a tray of cookies. Isn't that right, Al? Oh, need our ass. Yes. Over. I'm afraid that that is simply not allowed. And if you do not move immediately, then we must take steps to get rid of you. Over. Yeah? Well, bomb off. D. <laughs> What a rude woman. Hey. She was really rude, wasn't she? Mm -hmm. I've never even spoken to her like that before. So strange as well, because we normally get on so well with people involved in the world of blimp travel. Mm. I'm after you, Ed and Outcho. Oh. Apart from him. Oh, nice. Oh, he's back, is he? Oh, <sighs> you know what? I'm not sure this morning's going to be as relaxing as we'd hoped. Who would have thought? Uh, you know what I think we should do? Huh? But, yes, we could take steps to avoid this terrible predicament. Mm. I, I was thinking we could watch Elliot Kid. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hello there. You're watching.
watching Transmission Impossible with Ed and Outro. Now, we were planning on having a nice, relaxing morning, but that's been slightly thwarted by two things. One, we're squatting in the airspace of a major international airport, and they're not very pleased about it. Two, Peter Sensible from the AA, A, 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 is still on our tail. Now, if you were watching yesterday, and if you weren't, it's still available on the BBC iPlayer for another six days. You'll know that Peter Sensible sent up his health and safety officer, Tim Safe, to try and have a shutdown. Now, it didn't work, no. but he's still trying to get us. He's still after this blimp, and that's why we need you. It's time for this. Yes, Ed's great big spot. I keep meaning to change that name. You don't remind me. Just remind me in future. Okay, okay, it's a okay. terrible name. Um, yes, we were asking you to send in photos pretending to spot our blimp in the sky to confuse Peter Sensible. And we have been inundated with photos. These are just some of our favourites. We can't fit them all on the board. Have a look at these. Tear in Scarborough sent in that one. Look at that lovely Mary and Nat and Melton Mowbray claiming to have seen us. That should confuse him. We saw that one last week. Holly and Will. William in Middlesex there. In Bristol as well, Max is claiming to have seen us in his garden. Clara in Worcester is pretending to have seen us in a playground. It just goes on and on. And we've got even more to add as well. David in Muirkirk sent in this one here. He's claiming to have seen us in his bedroom. A very professional job. Then there's Ellie in Dumfries and Galloway claiming to have seen us in her garden. She's stuck on the end of a stick. Good initiative. And Thomas in Oxfordshire is pretending to have seen us in his bedroom. And look, he's even got his own outro there as well. Oh, look. Or is it one of your relatives? I'm not sure. Yeah. Anyway, put that one in the middle there. This is great. Dave. This is so good. The question is, is this enough? Have we managed to confuse Dave. Peter Sensible? Is he watching? Are you watching, Peter? Hello there. Peter Sensible from the AA. A. AA here, and I've adapted my highly technical and complex tracking equipment to finally track down the blimp of Ed and Ed show. So, let's find out where they are today, shall we? Ah, uh, yes. Oh, bingo, as they say. Just found them in the northeast of England. So, wait, oh, sorry, no. No, northwest. Uh, no, southwest. Oh, of Wales. Southwest of Wet. East Anglia. Cornwall? No, 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 no. Oh, oh no, we can't handle it. He's getting too many sightings. It's overloading. Oh, no, my equipment. My equipment. I think it's going to explode. <laughs> oh, oh, my equipment. My beautiful equipment. <laughs> uh, hello, boss. <laughs> uh, no, no, I haven't managed to track down Ed and Ed you as such, uh, because all the equipment's exploded. <laughs> yes, it was rather expensive, uh, but... Oh, no, don't fire me! What? Hello? Oh, no! Oh, I've just lost my job! Oh, I love my job! Without me, they'll never be tracked down! You can't get away with this! Oh, what about British standards? <laughs> <laughs> We've defeated Peter Sensible and we couldn't have done it without you. Thank you. Thank you, people of Britain. No more photos needed now. Job done. Oh, we can start enjoying our lazy morning again now. Oh, dear. Do you fancy a bit of crazy golf? Oh, lots of This is an instruction to Ed and Alcho. Please fly your blimp immediately into another area of the sky. Over. <laughs> Should we just watch Sorry Got No Head? Oh, dear. Yeah, if you ignore people, they go away. Hmm. <laughs> oh, Chakra. Eh, who are you? All right, all right. I'll find my zen later. <laughs> Hello, welcome back to Transmission Impossible with Ed and Outcho. I'm trying to have a nice, relaxing Sunday morning. 
Unfortunately, we've entered into a bit of a dispute with a major international airport. They, they don't want us in their airspace. Ooh, ooh, you're hovering in our airspace. Ooh, well, we're just going to stay here, aren't we? It's not like they own the sky. Actually, we do own the sky. Over. Yeah, well, we don't care. Their, their pilots should learn how to fly better. Uh, oh, 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 hey, lo, lo. What? What else? What's what? Lo. Oh, it's a helicopter. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Is that who I think it is? Huh? That, that sounds sugar. Off oh. of the telly with Nick oh. and Margaret. Oh, hey. eh, eh, in a blast now. Oh, yes, Lord Sal and Sugar. Oh, hey, they're waving. Yeah, I know, they're waving. Uh, hello. Oh. Hello. Oh. I didn't, I didn't realise they watched our show. This is great. Hey, why don't we start waving? I don't know why they're still waving. Probably because they like us so much. That was close, wasn't it? Oh, I think there's valuable lessons we learned from that, you know. Oh, yeah, what is it? What is it? I have absolutely no idea. No. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh no. As if we didn't have enough problems. Oh, Bob, 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 I'm no. bored of what I really am. Hey? Oh, it's not what I call a taste sensation. Do you know no. what I mean? No, 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 love, not really. Oh, I just crave something different. No. Something to get me taste buds tingling. No. Something exciting. Something I've no. never tried oh, before. Oh, yeah, like cherry wood, love. No, not like cherry wood. Mm. Like the things I read about in the magazines, mm. like smoked salmon and caviar and <gasps> oven chips. Oh, oh, I know. Wait there, love. Wait there. Oh. Bob? Bob, where have ah, you gone, Bob? Here we are, love. Look. Uh, what on earth is it? Rhubarb. Uh, what's rhubarb? Now, don't rightly know. I found it in the kitchen. Yeah, here, have a try, love. Oh, have a well, try. Oh, well, well yeah. if you insist. Mm. <laughs> oh. Oh, it's fantastic. Yeah. Oh, it's sweet and sour and yeah. crunchy and soft and... Oh, not at all, I wouldn't. Oh, 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 oh I don't oh, think it agrees with me. Oh, Bob, maybe I should stick to wood in future. Oh, yeah, love, yeah. Bit of elder. Oh, okay, <laughs> yeah, there's more and more of this sawdust appearing. <laughs> If we're not careful, this blimp might fall apart one of these days. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now, a little bit later than usual. Who said this show was formatted and predictable? It's time for the furnace! Ah, yeah! Oh, we're going to chuck some of your drawings in the furnace to fuel our engine. And, you know, like Ed's big spot, we've had loads and loads oh, of entries. In fact, we've got enough to keep us going for weeks. Mm -hmm. So you don't need to send any more in now. No. Oh, we're going to be up in the sky for a while, I reckon. Oh, so, dear. should we have a look at these pictures? OK, so there's this one here, sent ah. in by Abby from Lincoln. Look. Oh, to sing along, dear. That's right, it's you doing your sing along. Oh, dear. Holding a microphone there. Oh, sorry. And a bit of a frown. Maybe you're aware of the damage you're doing to people's ears. Oi. Being evil. Yeah, shut us. Uh, there's also this one here, sent in by Violet, age 10, that she did on her computer. Look at that. <gasps> oh, wow. That's just me with a messy hair there. Eh, no, 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 what, that there? Mm. Incho, your little brother from yesterday? Yeah, he's a bit singed, if it is. Huh? I, d I think it's an armchair in the background. Oh. Yeah, I'll, I'll teach you about perspective one of these days. Mm. And then there's this... Oh, this is... You'll like this. Oh, Remy from Manchester sent oh, in this one. I think that's the blimp at the bottom. And then, look, we're surrounded by butterflies. <laughs> oh, hey, I'm on the scars. And they're not vermin in the sky. I'm not lovely. No, I'm not getting a fly <laughs> spray. <laughs> no, no, they're an endangered species. They're nice. <laughs> oh, well, I, I, I think they're lovely. Anyway, thank you for that, Remy. Uh, <laughs> And you know what, actually, we get to this point in the afternoon. Afternoon? Me. Morning? Hmm. I don't know whether I'm coming or going. Come see, come see. Yeah. And then, and then I just completely forget what to do. What, what should we do with these? Hmm. 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 Ah. Ah. Oh. Hmm. Ah. Oh, air. Yes. Marbles. Yes. Marbles. Yes. Ghost marbles. Yeah, just maybe, yes. What else <gasps> we could do, possibly? Oh, marbles. Oh. We incinerate your pictures so that you don't have to. Uh, should we watch a bit of telly? Oh, dear. What do you fancy? Uh, totally Saturday. 
Not. Oh, no, no, of course not. Let's watch horrible histories. Mm. Yes, yeah, much better. Hello. Arusa da Trasbusa Apusa Miss Et and Ocho. He tells for Ocho's boss, Bondurag. Ocho's prince, Bondurag. So, your new item, mm -hmm. Ocho's thought for the day. The What's today's thought about? Elamas Clus Clots. Light bulbs. The Take it away. Clus Clots and the Fluda Suda Dada. And a full of Marcella Lali, the Tuk Tuk Ta. Then Rosla do the Sula Clusas and the Lulas Paris. Then Nosta do the Bioris Das on the Clusa Clusa Fleet as near. Oh, that's really touched me, actually. Hmm? I'd never thought that in so many ways we're like light bulbs, aren't we? Hey. Some of us are halogen light bulbs, mm -hmm. some of us are energy saving. It's the way we live our lives that matters. Mm -hmm. Oh, not air traffic control again. We really must insist that you leave this airspace immediately. Otherwise, we will have to take drastic action. Yeah. Over. Ooh, ooh, drastic action. Ooh, ooh, I'm so scared. Mummy, mummy. Yeah, well, we really must insist that you leave us alone. Because we're having a very nice time relaxing. So we'll get out of the way of your airplanes when we feel like it. Yeah, over. Over. <laughs> right, what do you feel like doing? Yeah. A game of I Spy. Oh, great. You know what, viewers? Sometimes I wonder why do we need computers, MP3s, when you can have a good old game of I Spy? Right. What do you fancy going for then? Go first? Uh, okay. It spits mm -hmm. come to la la to mm -hmm. Thomas Magala this <laughs> Something to do with H. <laughs> ah, hamster. No. Yes. Okay. Um, helium balloon. Ah, no. Neither of those. Mm -hmm. Hmm. No. Now, that was my guess. I was just going, hmm. No. That, that's not my guess. It's not. What is it, anyway? Eh. A Highland cow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, can you see a Highland cow in this blimp? Yeah. Uh, uh, oh, not. No, well, it's not a Highland cow, is it? You have to say something you can see in this room. Oh, dear. I'm not gonna go. <laughs> okay. B. 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 Nos. B. No, not saying B. Nos. I'm not saying B. Nos. OK, what is it? What is it? In a blue Soros Muras. A blimp-seeking missile. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go again. You're really not getting this, are you? What? Look, can you see a blimp-seeking missile in this blimp? No. I rest my case. Eh, I could as well as that. What do you mean you can see one outside? B. Ah, right. Mm -hmm. Ah. You know what, I think there's... There's two things we should do now. Oh. Uh, uh, the first thing is, is, is move this blimp immediately out of the airspace of the airport. They've obviously sent this missile up. And, and the other thing, uh, it's quite important, we do, we do it a lot at the end of our shows, actually, is <laughs> scream like okay. a big girl. <laughs> ah!